Hello. I joined uh, the Usher and Greeter Ministry in 2015 because they needed people to serve. But when I first joined, I really wasn't thinking about the duties I had to do, except that they were physical duties. I really, you know, never thought much more about that. I would have to say hello, give out bulletins, uh, collect new collections. But as time went on, I started to feel differently. I, I felt a more spiritual sense of, of what I was doing. Uh, I felt that we were a team that had a very important role to play in the church. I also gained great fulfillment and felt a very close, loving bond to the church community that I had never felt before. I think these changes came about for several reasons. One was my experience as, a, as an usher and greeter. The other is because I was taking Bible study classes and learning in more detail about Christ's ministry. I felt that our ministry actually tied very closely with the pillars of Christ's ministry. And let me give you some examples. Jesus welcomed people to his kingdom. While when I serve, I'm not just saying hello to people, I'm welcoming them into our Christian community. I give them a big smile, a familiar face, some conversation, and I make them feel welcome when they come into church. We also get a lot of visitors here from all around the world, and I'm sure normally they would feel strange coming into a new church, but we try to, again, make them feel comfortable and part of our community. Many of them come to us after Mass and tell us what a beautiful parish we have, beautiful service, what a warm and friendly place we have, and I'd like to think that our team is partly responsible for that impression. After all, we are the first people that people see when they come into church. Jesus also invited us to receive the Eucharist. We have two parts to play in that regard. We select the gift bearers that um, bring the gifts up to Father to start the Eucharistic process. We also get to share in the joy that many of them feel just by doing that. They come up to us after Mass and are so happy and say, thank you for choosing us. It was amazing. And the second part, of course, is when we do our managing our communion lines. We get to stand very close to people as they're going up to receive the Lord. And that is a very special time for me personally. We also learn in the Bible that Jesus' followers supported his ministry. Well, each time we take up collections, every weekend, we are uh, encouraging people to support Jesus' ministry through our parish. These uh, collections are very important to the uh, survival of our church and the growth of our church. Jesus taught us to care about each other and love each other. So each time that I serve, not only am I welcoming people, but I'm also helping people who have special needs need special attention, people that are sick, maybe during Mass that I need to help, or they have questions about the church, the chapel, or Sedona. You know, in closing, I'd like to make one observation. I've come to believe that a lot of parishioners see what we do every week, and they are reluctant to join a ministry because they think that it will take from their Mass time. Well, as an usher and a greeter, I feel very differently about that. I feel that not only am I participating in the Mass, but I've been offered a unique way to serve the Lord and His followers. And honestly, I can't think of a better way to show my love for Jesus than to be part of this ministry. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.